Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered weak and weary, over many a quaint and curious volume of forgotten lore. While I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a tapping, as of someone gently rapping at my chamber door. Tis some visitor, I muttered, tapping at my chamber door. Only this and nothing more. Ah, distinctly I remember, it was in the bleak December, and the separate dying ember brought its ghost upon the floor. Eagerly I wished the morrow, vainly I had sought to borrow from my book surcease of sorrow for the lost Lenore. For the rare and radiant maiden whom the angels named Lenore, nameless here forevermore. Deep into that darkness peering, long I stood there wondering, fearing, doubting, dreaming, dreams no mortal ever dared to dream before. But the silence was unbroken, and the stillness gave no token, and the only words there spoken was the whispered word Lenore. This I whispered, and an echo murmured back the word Lenore, merely this and nothing more. Open here I flung the shutter, when with many a flip and flutter, in there stepped a stately raven of the saintly days of yore. Not the least obeisance made he, not a minute stopped or stayed he, but with me a lord or lady perched upon my chamber door. Perched upon a bust of palace just above my chamber door. First and sat and nothing more. Then this ebony bird beguiling, I set fancy into smiling by the grave and stern decorum of the countenance it wore. Though thy crest be shorn and shaven, thou I said art sure no craven, ghastly grim and ancient raven, wandering from the nightly shore. Tell me what thy lordly name is on this night's Plutonian shore, quoth the raven, nevermore. Then methought the air grew denser, perfume from an unseen censer, sung by seraphim whose footfalls tingle on the trumpet floor. Wretch, I cried, thy God has lent thee, by these angels he has sent thee, leave my loneliness unbroken with the bust above my door. Demons that is dreaming, and the lamp like or is streaming, throws his shadow on the floor, and my soul from out that shadow that lies floating on the floor shall be lifted evermore.